snow in Siberia can influence our winters here in the United States? Yes, yes it can, and here's how. Hi there everyone, I'm ABC 13 meteorologist Elise Smith. Winter is off to a fast and furious start across the country, and the snowpack all the way in Siberia might have something to do with it. So back in October, this region in Northern Asia witnessed several snow events that led to a deep and vast snowpack developing across the area. The result of that has been a stronger Siberian high that sits over that part of the world. And within a couple of weeks, this strong Siberian high can begin to influence other weather patterns across the Northern Hemisphere, all the way up to the North Pole, where the polar vortex resides. Now pair these changes and influences with a sudden stratospheric warming event in the North Pole. All of this combined can allow for the polar vortex to move and migrate farther south, it breaking down and sending cold air outbreaks and snow events to North America, including much of the United States. And we've already kind of seen hints of that this year with several snow events and cold weather events already occurring and winter hasn't even officially begun yet even though meteorological winter began on December 1st. Overall, this is another great example of what we call teleconnection patterns, when one weather pattern in one part of the world can influence another weather pattern in another part of the world. 